Some CS2 skins are very expensive, but you have absolutely no idea how expensive they can actually be. And that is why in this video I'll go over the top 10 most expensive CS2 skins in existence. So in the 10th place we have the Karambit Crimson Web in Factor New. These knives are very very rare in Factor New, in fact there are only 49 in existence and the best Crimson Webs are called Tier 1 Patterns and the these are super rare so imagine how rare they are if they are tier 1 patterns and also factor new. That is what's happening with this one that I'm showing in the video, it has a pattern 59 which is a tier 1 pattern and because of this is considered the best Karambit Crimson Web in existence and it has sold for over $14,000 and if you think this number is crazy this is the absolute cheapest skin in this video so get ready because it is going to be even crazier in the ninth place we have the butterfly knife doppler but this is not just a normal doppler this is a sapphire and these are very very rare to get the sapphire basically means that the butterfly knife is completely blue and at the peak of the cs2 hype keep in mind that at the time this was very overpriced but these knives were selling for over 25 thousand dollars on buff that is just crazy and before we go to number eight this video was sponsored by skins monkey skins monkey is a csgo trading platform where you can trade your old rusty csgo skins for some new shiny ones in just a few seconds the way it works is pretty simple you select the skins you want to trade and you select the ones you want to get you click trade and it's done if you use my code osni on the website you get a bonus of up to five dollars for absolutely free when you trade on the website and you also get a 35 percent bonus when buying balance on top of that they have daily weekly and monthly giveaways in the freebies page the link to the website is in the description and thank you skins monkey for sponsoring this video in the number eight spot we have the number one lowest float ak-47 gold arabesque in factory new this skin is crazy expensive, this was traded up by Sparkles and he is currently selling it for about $50,000 on CS Float, I'm not sure it is worth that much but from what I've seen and from what I've read this should be worth at least $45,000. In the 7th place we have the Sport Gloves Pandora's Box and these gloves were released in the first ever glove case but they are super super rare in factory new and the highest sale of these gloves in factory new happened in May of 2023 and they sold for a total of $50,000 yes you heard that correctly $50,000 for a pair of gloves and this is only the number 7 skin in this video in the 6th place we have the Op Gunnir in Factory New and this skin came out in 2019 and there's around 3500 of these in existence. A Battle Scar version will currently cost you about $7000 but the most expensive Gunnir possible is the number one lowest float which is right now on sale on CS Float for about $100,000 and although it's probably not worth that much it is estimated that this skin that you're seeing right now is worth at least $65,000 to $80,000 and now going over to the top 5 this is about to get insane in the 5th place we have the AK-47 Wild Lotus in Factor New and this one has 4 Katowice 2014 Reason Hollows so this skin is absolutely insane and it sold for a record fee of $160,000. This sold on buff back in March of 2023 and there are less than 3000 Wild Lotus in total circulation so this skin is somewhat short supply but the crazy thing is that this skin that you're seeing right now in the screen that sold for $160,000 is probably not even the most expensive Wild Lotus because there is one that is lower float and has 4x Titan Hollow stickers so that one is probably worth more than this that I'm showing but it has not been sold so we can't get a proper number on it so I can't really count it for the video. In the fourth place we have the Statrak M4A4 Howl in Factory New. The M4A4 Howl is one of the most iconic skins in Counter-Strike as it is a counterbound skin. I'm not gonna go over why it is that way because I think that everyone knows the story behind the Howl 
but the most expensive M4 house sold in CS history happened in April of 2023, in which this house that you're seeing right now with 4x i by power hollows sold for about $210,000 on a Twitter auction. This number is absolutely insane, but the crazy part is people still argue that this was cheap and it should have sold for more. In the third place we have the AK-47 case hardened blue gem and AK blue gems with a 661 pattern are worth about $50,000 and they are extremely rare and the one that you're seeing right now has a 661 pattern but the thing is as you can see this one is 4x titan hollow stickers so it makes it even more insane. This skin that you're seeing right now sold for $400,000 back in April of 2023. This is absolutely insane. And now we're going over to the top two. In the second place we have the Souvenir of Dragon Lore in Factory New. This is the most expensive op skin in CS2 and there are only about 114 of these in existence and a factory new version is worth around $150,000 depending on the float obviously but the thing is that the top two souvenir of Dragon Lords in terms of float have had their stickers scratched so they are basically souvenir but without the stickers. And the third lowest float was also scratched but the owner decided to put 4x titan holo on it. That is probably the biggest flex in CS skin history but the most expensive op dragon lore in souvenir is the one which I'm showing in this video and this is worth around $430,000. What a crazy number for an op skin. But if you think that's crazy, you are not ready for number one because this is the Karambit Case Hardened Blue Gem and this is not just a normal Karambit, this knife has the 387 pattern which makes it the most epic skin in Counter Strike history. The chances of unboxing this knife are 1 in <coughs> 371 million. That is absolutely insane. This knife was bought in 2016 for about a hundred thousand dollars but that was 2016 so it is now worth so much more. Just so you get an idea a well-worn version of this knife sold for the same one hundred thousand dollars this year and that is well worn so imagine how much a factory new one is. This skin has not been sold recently but the current owner which bought it back in 2016 refused a 1.5 million dollar offer for this knife. 1.5 million dollars refused and he speculated that right now this knife is worth about 2 million. I have no idea how to react to that number, that is absolutely insane. We're talking about pixels in a video game, it is absolutely insane. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed make sure to leave your like and subscribe for daily CS2 videos.